Hello, I'm Glenn. Welcome to my channel, Tired Old Man. What you're seeing in the picture is the house that I was raised in. This house was built pre-Civil War and the house has been in my family since it was built. My early ancestors built this house and it's been passed down from generation to generation and it's very near and dear to my heart. What you're seeing now is a picture that was taken from a newspaper article that was done in February of 1976. It was almost a full page article that was done on the house and my Aunt Cor Smith. The newspaper story goes into some of the history of the house and tells some of it and I'll get into that in some later clips and we will dive deep into the history of this house. But what I wanted to do now is just kind of introduce myself and tell you kind of what you can look for from my channel. If you've tuned in and found my channel and are looking for just a 30 minute clip on some history, that's not what we're going to do. I'm going to show you the behind the scenes, what it's really like to restore a historical house and bring it back to life after we move it. We will go into why we had to move this house. And this clip was just kind of a little short segment showing what we're doing to get ready to move the house. But uh, in future clips, what we're going to do is we'll go back and show you how we got ready to move the house, what brought us to this point, why are we moving the house. And then we'll show you the move of the house actually when it was being moved uh, from start to finish. You'll get to see that. And then after the house is moved, we'll show you the process that we went through, all the decision making, everything that we had to go through to try to bring this house back. Were we going to restore it and bring it back to its original glory like it was 200 years ago? Were we going to modernize it and make it modern? We'll show you all the decisions we had to go through and what we had to do to get to that point and make the decisions. You ride right along with us as we made those decisions and it's, I hope you'll be interested and follow along. You'll get to see some amazing things. Some things that were done over 200 years ago that we found when we started uh, restoring the house. We're going to get into a lot of things on my channel, not just the restoration of the house. We're going to get into the farm, which has also been in my family for hundreds of years. And we're going to get into a new farm that I purchased, an abandoned farm that I want to bring into my channel. And what it's like to bring uh, an abandoned farm back to life. But what you're seeing now is the house is actually being pulled off of its foundation. And looking at this and filming this was almost like watching my childhood drive away. It was kind of hard to watch at the time, but it was also very exciting to know that we were going to be starting on the rebuild and the, and the restoration. When I filmed this, I didn't film it to start a YouTube channel. I was filming this for my own personal use. But I'm also going to try to show as much of the raw footage, so to speak, like it was when I filmed it, on the day that I filmed it, not just for the YouTube. Hey, you might as well drive around on the path and just meet us back there. You might as well just drive around and get on the path back there by Eddie B. Give your mama the camera so if you're not going to go. To say that we were nervous about the move is an understatement. If you will look at the house, you can see where the roof is buckling where the siding is actually pulling away from the house and it's buckling. We didn't even know if the house was going to survive the move. After all, it is a 200 year old house. So we were just hoping it would survive the move at the time. But luckily it did survive the move. And we'll hope you will follow along and see what happens to this house after we dive into the restoration and get started on restoring it. And I hope you'll follow along on my channel and see all the other things that a tired old man can get involved in. 
all the adventures we can uh, get into and all the fun we can have. Restoring a house, bringing a farm back to life. Thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next video.